Hello everyone, Susie Gaming here and welcome to the dev server. I'm going to show you some vehicles they're adding in the next War Thunder update. First, let's begin with the mutant tanks. These are hilarious, such as this Sherman with the Pershing turret. PR of 6.0, as you can see, looks extremely derpy. It's kind of similar to the Israeli M51, but of course with the larger caliber. Another mutant is Rakuten Automat, turret of the Ush. And all is from Rocket and Yakpanzer. And in the US Tech 3, Neo Soviet Abrams, BR of 10.3. The most important stuff about it, it has explosive armor protection. It's happening, 8 wheeled VTRs. Never wanted to see them in the game, but unfortunately, here they are. And at the BR of 5.7, when I first seen this, I thought there will be a bit more higher BR, but yeah, these things will fight against Hellcats. PTR-80 has a 30mm autocannon as a primary gun. I don't know if my brain can get used to BTRs and Tigers fighting against each other. What a shit show. So yeah, this vehicle will confuse Hellcat players even more. I guess it's time to switch to simulator battle. Doesn't have stabilizer, it can swim. Can pop smoke. I really like the turret, looks modern. Unfortunately, it has only three crew members, which is a shame because hull is extremely ginormous. You could stick like extra two crewmates there. I can see some hatches at the back of the turret. Cannon sounds powerful, but... For some reason, it takes ages to kill. As you can see, frontally no chance. Can take tracks easily though. It also has machine gun. So it's also getting the new Frogfoot, SU-25T, and the brother of it, SU-39. As you can see between the old SU-25K, the difference is the new one is a bit more chunkier. Developers also introduced brand new retarded bombs, they're calling it that way. Uh, they're basically parachute bombs that's made for ultra-low altitude bombing. By the way, most of the planes will receive these bombs uh, with more and more updates. Just spam it. Wow. This is how they work. Uh, but yeah, again, not sure why would you even bomb at 11.3 battle. Something tells me efficiency of this plane will be really bad, but of course, we're gonna see it on release. How it will perform. Object 435, really interesting design. I really like this frontal shape and if you think it's weaker, consider it twice uh, because it actually has more protection than the regular sloped armor. Check out T62. Efficient thickness is 185 here, yeah, but here 220. So almost 40 millimeter more thicker. But if you're gonna hit top of this triangle it's getting weaker and weaker check this out 106 79 52 it's glass now this part is quite weak but if you shoot somewhere here maybe you're not gonna pen uh, from far distance the bottom plate is also strong to 50 millimeters side is of course more exposed it has a huge dishka machine gun T62 doesn't have it. Looks interesting. This one got a new weapon. It has rockets, <laughs> as you can see. 5.3 Bravey. In the US, we have F 14B. Here's the loadout. Check out 
Chinese top tier J8F. And China also receiving object 211, which is basically type 63, but lower in BR. It has same 85mm cannon, but it's located at 5.0. And here's the Fresia Italian 10.0 IFV. It has spike missiles. This time, legit spike missiles. You can see it even says here. Uh, basically what we got uh, with that Chinese ATGM launcher, fire and forget ATGM. So yeah, Italy is the first tank that received spike missile in War Thunder. Let's quickly test it out. Locked, fired. Bam. Unfortunately, no camera tracking like it had in April Fool's events. I also seen a lot of footage where, like real life spike test footage, it had a camera at the tip of the missile. So you could see until it reaches the target, you could have looked around, etc. So yeah, in the game apparently it's really broken, they didn't add that. I don't know. Where did it lock? No, that's stupid. Okay. <laughs> it has auto cannon with penetration 80mm. Here's the parameters of the spike missile. 700 millimeters penetration the speed is 180 meters per second explosive mass 900 grams possibly this missile will be added to puma as well an original spike missile is made in israel rival to the beacon of one a lot of ground players i think gonna like this one they basically slapped the house on top of mx30 and the caliber is similar to the Swedish Bacon 155. It has 7.5 seconds of reloading time. Here is the ammunition 54 millimeters of pen. A small crown as well. And as last tank, I want to show 8.3 hydro tank. It's really. It has this rocket tubes. Where does it even fire? <laughs> Okay. Currently, <laughs> something wrong with the aim. Oh no, something is wrong with the aim. You actually need to look a bit down. Oh, here we go. <laughs> It has two 90 millimeters of pen, but the yeah, aim wise, a little bit toxic. I guess it will be useful in the close range encounters. If you miss with the main cannon, you can spray these. There we go. So yeah, actually that's it. Tell me which vehicle you liked most in the comment section. I'll see you in the next one.